In this video, I'm going to show you how to set up and use Gemini with Janitor AI. Now, the first thing you want to do, you want to go to janitorai.com and of course you want to sign into your account. And then after this, you want to find one of your chats over here. So it can be a new one or one of the ones you've already been talking with. And then you can press on continue to get into the chat. Now, mind you, this is not going to be possible with all the chats. However, most of the chats will allow you to use proxies. Now, as you can see, this one says using proxy because I've set this up already. I'm going to show you how to in a second. However, if I go to this one, for example, over here, it says that no proxy and then something. This usually means you can't really use proxies in here. I've tried it. It doesn't work. And as you can see, if I just type something in, it's going to basically say proxies are forbidden for this character. Now, if this happens, you will unfortunately have to go to a different character. But for me over here, I found one that does work and I'm going to show you how to set this up. So the first thing you want to do is you want to go ahead click on those three lines and then click on API settings inside your chat. Then switch the proxy over here and then click on custom under model and then make sure you copy and paste this in. It's going to be down below in the description. So paste this part in over here. And then once you do that, make sure you paste this one in here as well. So under other proxy or other API or proxy URL, make sure you place that in here. And when you click on check API key slash model, you could get an error or not. So this depends. Now for me, I don't have an error right now, as you can see, but sometimes you get it. Just don't worry about it. Just go past it. Nothing bad will happen. Now, these two things can be copied. However, when it comes to the API key, you will need your own. And let me show you how to get it. Now, you want to go to aistudio.google.com and you want to sign into your account. And then after you've signed into your account, click on get API key up top and then create API key. Here you'll have to select one of your projects. I'm just going to select a, a random one over here and I'm going to click on create API key. And then this is going to start loading and within just a few seconds, your API key will be generated. Now, as you can see, it's over here. Make sure you copy this and you will only be able to see this once. So make sure you copy it and place it somewhere safe. And then after you do it, go in here, place it inside the API key box where it says API key and make sure double check that it's the correct one. And after you do it, you can try click and check API. If it gives an error, don't worry. If it doesn't that much better. Now here you can then also add in a custom prompt. And of course you can add it if you want to set the behavior of the bot. I'm just going to skip this step right now, but you are free to do that in case you want something like that. Now, here, in case you've forgotten your API key or forgot to copy it, don't worry about it. Just create a new one and then paste that one in. It's going to work just as well. Now, after all of this has been done, double check that everything is correct over here and then click on save settings. Once you do this, you can then start chatting to your character. For example, yo, what's up? I'm just going to start typing and there we go. As you can see, there we go. It's answering and it says using proxy up here, which means the proxy is now actually working and I can start using it. And Gemini has been successfully connected and used with Janitor AI. So that's pretty much it. I hope this video helped you out. If it did, please subscribe to the channel and help me out as well.